Today I'll show you a few interesting things about calcium carbide. If you mix it together with water you get a gas which is ethine and um, this gas is uh, C2H2 and it's very flammable and I think we're going to try that. But first I want to show you something else. So this calcium carbide um, is normally white crystals but I could only buy it in those uh, yeah, gray chunks or in those nuggets. So I got this 500 grams for 5 euros and if you put it together with water, okay, there's ethine but there's also a salt produced which, which is calcium hydroxide and this is a base of course and our Promptimol blue solution will show up that it's in base. So I'm going to put a bit of water in a test tube and then add a few drops of Promptimol blue which is an indicator. Now after I mix it a bit it turned green which means that it's a it's neutral and now if I add a small piece of calcium carbide what you can see is that it turns blue and okay yeah that was a bit too much water and blue means that it's a base so in this base is calcium hydroxide okay I should have added less water and what you can feel is that it's an exothermic reaction so it turns hot. Now I want to show you how calcium carbide burns so I put a small little piece of calcium carbide here in there and I put some water on it and light it up What you can see is that a lot of carbon black is produced. You can see it fly here, flying everywhere. And that's clear when you look at the general formula of ethane. I'll show it you later. And you can find many videos on YouTube where people put ethane in balloons and light it up and then they explode, that's because it's very flammable and once again you can see it even explodes a bit the bubbles explode and that's the sound Now that's a chemical equation of the reaction of carbide with water and um, when you look at the molecular structure of ethane which looks like this it's no wonder that there's that much carbon black produced because if you compare this to methane, methane which looks like this there's much more carbon and less hydrogen so the carbon doesn't burn at all and that's why there are those black black things flying around because there's still carbon left